The number 21 ranked Washington State Cougars open up Pac-12 play against number 14 Oregon State Saturday. There's a bittersweet feeling heading into the conference schedule this year. Conference realignment has left WSU and OSU as the last remaining Pac-12 teams after this season. Sports Director Julian Minnesota is in Pullman with more on the Cougars final run at a conference championship in the current Pac-12. Saturday may be the first time fans actually cheer for an opposing team as they run out onto the field. Washington State and Oregon State have been in lockstep this entire offseason through conference realignment. We know from the outside sources that we're not a power five team, so we have something to go prove each day in, day out. Washington State and Oregon State are the only remaining Pac-12 teams after this season. Both schools have been working together to preserve their futures and find a new conference home. Members who have announced that they are leaving to join a competitor are no longer have any loyalty to the Pac-12 and cannot be entrusted to make decisions on behalf of the Pac-12. WSU and OSU were granted a temporary restraining order preventing the departing schools from making decisions that impact the future of the conference. Oregon State University President Jayathi Murthy tweeted, Go Beavs, go Cougs, just one day after both schools filed that legal complaint against the Pac-12. <laughs> Oregon State fans were cheering when WSU took down Wisconsin earlier this month. The Cougars and Beavers have been on the same team all season long. But Saturday, it'll be anything but friendly on the field. We kind of see it as the last year of the Pac-12, so we want to take it. We want to be the last one with the Rose. Washington State University President Kirk Schultz tells us October 1st is the target date to figure out the future for Washington State and presumably Oregon State as well. Kickoff is at 4 o'clock here on Saturday. But for now, reporting in Pullman, Julian Minnesota, 4 News Now Sports.